My name is Peter Fury. I'm the Director of Research and Innovation Interim at Southern Health NHS Foundation Trust and we are University Hospital Trust. And I really got inspired by the clinicians, by the patients, by the patients' families to want to do research. It benefits the people that we work with, the people that we work for, and also us. And research is fun. It's all focused around innovation, new ways of thinking, of making clinical aspects better, always trying to better uh, the work that we do. I think with research, in the, especially when working on the wards, it's, it's such a busy environment and we lose focus on the fact of bettering the care. We get so stuck on maintaining the care that we give because it works at the moment, but I always think there's room for improvement. New research that came from Southampton where they were developing a, a decision tool for people with motor neuron disease to work out whether or not they want a feeding tube and previously we were doing that in conversation but now we've got a tool that's validated in research that we can use with patients and help them make that difficult decision. We'd, we'd love to do more research because it's been made so easy for us by the trust. The most exciting thing I think we've got at the moment is split posts, so nurses and allied healthcare professionals can apply to have one or two days of their regular working week to spend working with us in the research centre and I think that really produces a really nice balance. This unit actually was one of the reasons why we've got cholinesterase inhibitors, which are the drugs which most people use for Alzheimer's disease. We were the very first centre to actually start those treatments. We have a research study we're conducting at Southern Health that is looking at psychosis and it's a simple blood test but that blood test can determine whether or not it is more of a physical health consequence rather than a mental health consequence. Currently there's a study going on around the RSV virus. They are asking children who are under one to come to appointments to have an immunisation and, and then they're going to assess the effectiveness of that immunisation. There are opportunities for everyone in our organisation to be involved and our success is your success and we really want you to be part of that and you can be part of that. You can contact us or come and talk to us about any of the areas that you're interested in and we can turn those ideas into, into solutions.